Hello children, welcome to your English video class. Children, you know uh, that uh, in English we are doing grammar and in grammar we are doing more about nouns. Children, this unit uh, we have been doing since past uh, uh, many videos because this unit has two parts. Uh, first one uh, was uh, the noun numbers. Uh, which is uh, which was related to singular and plural form of nouns and uh, the second section is related to gender that is masculine feminine gender uh, in general and uh, common and neuter gender also so uh, the first part the first section uh, that is uh, noun numbers singular and plural form of nouns uh, that I have completed with you. I have given you sufficient uh, nouns and uh, their plural forms from your grammar book as well as from the uh, textbook. I have picked uh, nouns from your textbook, the singular form of nouns uh, from your textbook and I have given you the plural forms of those nouns. I have explained to you the rules of uh, changing a single noun into plural noun and uh, then I have started uh, the second part of this unit that is masculine and feminine gender. This also I have explained what uh, is masculine gender, what is feminine gender, what is common gender, what is neuter gender, all these I have explained in my previous video. आपने पिछले वीडियो में ये सारा मैंने आपको एक्सप्लेन किया है इनके एग्जांपल्स भी दिए हैं आपको मैंने बहुत सारे एग्जांपल्स दिए हैं मस्कुलिन जेंडर के फैमिलिन जेंडर के देन आपको मैंने कॉमन जेंडर्स और न्यूट्रल जेंडर्स के भी बहुत सारे एग्जांपल्स दिए हैं और हमने स्टार्ट किया था एक्सरसाइज द एक्सरसाइजेस रिलेटेड टू जेंडर मस्कुलिन जेंडर एंड फेमिनाइन जेंडर और आज के वीडियो में भी हम एक्सरसाइज ही कंटिन्यू करेंगे कुछ एक्सरसाइज हम कर चुके हैं और कुछ एक्सरसाइजेस हमें अभी करना बाकी है जो इस टॉपिक से रिलेटेड है तो जहां पर हमने अपना पिछला वीडियो छोड़ा था वी विल कंटिन्यू फ्रॉम देयर ओनली आई हैव स्टार्टेड एन एक्सरसाइज एंड वेयर यू हैव टू चूज द करेक्ट ऑपोजिट जेंडर ऑफ द गिवन नाउन और गिवन वर्ड and uh, in this question we have done two and we will continue with some more isme hum kuch aur karenge aur ek do exercises aur karenge so uh, without wasting no much time we will start with the exercise hum karna shuru karte hain exercise choose the correct opposite gender of the following nouns or i can say words Choose the correct opposite gender of the following nouns or words. मतलब कुछ nouns दिए होंगे gender form में आपको options भी मिलेंगे You have to choose the correct answer, the correct opposite gender of the given noun. So uh, let's do. Uncle. And the options are mother, niece, aunt, lady. What is the opposite gender of uncle? अंकल का ऑपोजिट जेंडर क्या होता है मदर नीज आंट और लेडी 
इन फोर ऑप्शंस में से जो करेक्ट ऑप्शन होगा उस पर आपको सर्कल करना है या टिक लगाना है विच एवर वे यू वॉन्ट टू सेलेक्ट यू कैन सेलेक्ट सो द ऑपोजिट जेंडर ऑफ अंकल इज आंट ऑपोजिट जेंडर ऑफ अंकल इज आंट नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट इज वाइफ एंड द ऑप्शन आर हजबेंड मैन अंकल और सन वी हैव फोर ऑप्शन द ऑपोजिट जेंडर ऑफ वाइफ इज ऑप्शन आर हजबेंड मैम अंकल और सन चिल्ड्रन द करेक्ट आंसर इज हजबेंड हजबेंड इज द ऑपोजिट जेंडर ऑफ वाइफ नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट इज हेन options are r o o s t e r rooster d r a k e drake d r o n e drone r Tag. Opposite gender of hen is rooster, drake, drone or stag. Children, the correct answer is rooster. जो बड़ा वाला मुर्गा होता है मुर्गा बोलते हैं जिसको तो वो होता है opposite gender hen का Hen का opposite gender है rooster. Next, number फोर Number फोर is brother. Options are daughter, sister, girl, or aunt. वर्ड इज ब्रदर हमारा जो नाउन है वो है ब्रदर तो ब्रदर का ऑपोजिट जेंडर क्या होगा डॉटर सिस्टर गर्ल या फिर आंट एंड चिल्ड्रन द करेक्ट आंसर इज सिस्टर ब्रदर का ऑपोजिट जेंडर क्या होता है सिस्टर ब्रदर सिस्टर नेक्स्ट Number five, gentleman, and opposite gender is woman. Lady, daughter. Or wife. What is the opposite gender of a gentleman? Is it a woman, lady, daughter, or a wife? Children, the opposite gender of gentleman is lady. Gentleman, lady. Gentleman, lady. So. We are over with this exam, uh, this exercise, and now we will do another exercise. This exercise is our complete. Now we will do the second exercise. Okay? Just go through it.
Now, another exercise is put the nouns in their correct column. Put the nouns in their correct column. Uh, now, you will get some nouns in a box and you have to put them in their correct column. Now, let me write the nouns first. Options are Tiger Father Wife Hero Actress Son Duck, Princess, Servant, Bull, Mare, God, Dog, daughter, boy, and woman. These are some nouns. Now you have to separate them according to their gender. जो भी gender है उसके हिसाब से उन्हें आपको अलग अलग columns में डालना है. Now here is the column of masculine gender. And next is the column of feminine gender. Masculine gender and feminine gender. Now what we have to do? We have to pick each noun and we have to put them in the correct column. Okay. Let's do first one. Tiger. Children, tiger. Uh, tiger is a masculine uh, gender or feminine gender? It's a masculine gender. So we will write here. टाइगर जो होता जाएगा उसको हम क्रॉस करते जाएंगे ठीक है नेक्स्ट इज फादर फादर अगेन इज अ मस्कुल जेंडर नेक्स्ट इज वाइफ चूडन वाइफ इज अ फेमिनाइन जेंडर वाइफ का मस्कुल जेंडर क्या होगा हस्बैंड फादर का फेमिनाइन जेंडर क्या होता है मदर टाइगर का फेमिनाइन जेंडर क्या होता है टाइगरेस ओके सो वाइफ शुड बी अंडर दिस कॉलम देन वी हैव हीरो चिल्ड्रन हीरो इज अ मस्कुलिन जेंडर द फेमिनाइन जेंडर और फेमिनाइन जेंडर ऑफ हीरो इज हेरोइन बट here we have hero which is a masculine gender next is actress children actress is a feminine gender the masculine gender of actress is actor 
actress it comes under feminine gender next is son son is a masculine gender and its opposite gender is daughter here we have son which is a masculine gender now next uh, noun is duck children duck is a feminine gender the masculine gender of duck is drake duck will come under feminine gender then we have princess now you all know that princess is a feminine gender the masculine gender for princess is prince then we have servant children servant is a masculine gender s e r v a n t servant is a masculine gender and its feminine gender is maid servant servant maid servant next we have bull now bull bull is a masculine gender bull is a masculine gender its feminine gender is cow so we will write bull under masculine gender now we have uh, next word let's see which one next one is mayor m a r e mayor and mayor is a feminine gender mayor jo hai wo feminine gender hota hai aur iska opposite gender hota hai horse horse jo hai wo masculine gender hota hai aur mayor is a feminine gender then we have god mayor humne kar liya hai god now god god kya common gender hai no god is a masculine gender god jo hai wo masculine gender hai aur god ka feminine gender hota hai goddess god goddess theek hai goddess jo hai wo feminine gender hai aur god jo hai wo masculine gender hai next is dog dog now dog is a masculine gender dog is a masculine gender its feminine gender is bitch the feminine gender of dog is bitch then we have daughter daughter children a uh, daughter is a feminine gender and its masculine gender is son so we have both uh, the genders in this column daughter bhi hai hamare uh, isme group mein aur son bhi hai we will write daughter here under the feminine gender column then uh, we have boy boy is a masculine gender yes the opposite gender of boy is girl then we have woman woman is a feminine gender woman jo hai wo feminine gender hai aur uska jo opposite gender hota hai wo hota hai man woman will come under this category feminine gender mein wo aayega theek hai so with this we come to the end of this exercise also please go through it so, now let's do another exercise
Next one is complete the sentences below by filling in the opposite gender of the underlined nouns. Now again here what you have to do, you have to complete the sentence now. Complete the sentences by by filling the opposite gender. of the following words now i'm going to write a few sentences what do you have to do you have to write the uh, opposite gender in the blank given in the sentence there will be a blank and you have to write the opposite gender in the blank Opposite gender of which word? The underlined words. Okay? Which usme ko, her sentence me ek jo noun hai wo underlined hoga. And you have to write the opposite gender of that underlined noun. Okay? First one. The lion and the dash look after their cubs their cubs the underlying word is lion the lion and the dash look after the cubs now, the underlying word is lion, so you have to write the opposite gender of lion. What is the opposite gender of lion? It is lioness. The opposite gender of lion is lioness. Children, one more thing which is very important in this is spelling. Uh, you may be knowing the opposite gender, but you should know the spelling also of the opposite gender. Orally you can say, orally you can tell, but while writing, if you commit mistake, if you write wrong spelling, then the answer will be wrong. So, learn the spelling also along with learning the opposite genders. Aapko spelling bhi yaad karna hai. The spelling of lioness, the lion and the lioness look after their cubs. Next one is the king and the dash rule over the kingdom wisely. Here the underlying word is king. The king and the blank rule over the kingdom wisely. Now the opposite gender of king is queen. The opposite of king is queen. So you will write queen. And children earlier also have told you the pronunciation is queen and not queen. Because very often people pronounce queen as kyun, which is wrong. It is not kyun, it is queen. King, queen. The king and the queen rule over the kingdom wisely. Next is the farmer used the bull in the field
and sold the milk of the black. The farmer used the bull in the field and sold the milk of the black. Now here the underlying word is bull. Now you have to write the opposite gender of bull. Bull ka opposite gender aapko likhna hai. Jo, kyunki underlying word jo hai wo bull hai. So you have to write the opposite of bull is cow. C O W. The farmer used the bull in the field and sold the milk of the cow. Got it? I hope ye aapko samaj mein aa raha hoga kis tarah se ise karna hai. Let's do one more sentence. Sentence number four. And it is She is my sister. She is my sister. I am her black. And the underlying word is sister. Okay? She is my properly is underlying. She is my sister. I am her black. Now, what is the opposite gender of sister? Because sister is underlined. Which means you have to write the opposite gender of sister. And it, the answer is brother. B R O T H E R. Okay. She is my sister. I am her brother. Okay. So uh, here we have done four sentences and we have. Uh, some more sentences to do. Isi tarah ki abhi hume aur bhi sentences karne hai. There you have to write the opposite gender and then you have to complete the uh, sentence. This we will do. Let me rub this. Next one is number six. Number six kya hai? Uh, there is there is one horse and one plan in the stable. Stable is the place where horses are kept. Now here the underlying word is horse. There is one horse and one blank in the stable. What is the opposite of horse? Opposite gender? It is mare. M-A-R-E. Mare. There is one horse and one mare in the stable. Then number seven. The gods, the god and blank are prayed. The god and blank are prayed and the underlined word is god. So here you have to write the opposite of God. Now what is the opposite of God? Opposite of God is Goddess. Double D, double S, Goddess. Children, 
I have told you that you should know the spelling also. Uh, apart from knowing the opposite gender, you should know the spelling of the opposite gender also. So, God and Goddess, you may be knowing the uh, opposite gender, that is Goddess, but you should also know the spelling, okay? God and Goddesses are prayed. So, uh, let's wind up the uh, the video here only. We have many more sentences uh, in this pattern to uh, to be done, but we will do that in the next video. Baki ke jo bache hai sentences hai, wo hum karenge apne next video mein. Aaj ke liye nahi. To milte hain next video mein. Thank you.